After your knockout, there were USA chants. For someone who loves this country, for you, what was that like? Bro, I, I am the biggest fucking American. And this is a problem when you critique America, when you say, you know what, like, put America first. I don't want to go spend money on other countries. I don't want to go fucking bomb other countries America first. People somehow put you in an un-American category. Motherfucker, I want your money to stay in your paycheck. I don't want to give money to any other fucking country. We got poor people here. What we spent on the Ukraine war, and again, I'm pro-Ukraine. I want Ukraine to win. What we spent on the Ukraine war could have financed our cancer treatments for like five years. Again, don't, don't quote me on this, but what we spent, if we would have put that all to cancer treatments, we would have been able to finance cancer treatments for five years. So again, I'm an American first. I, I, want, I want everybody to succeed. I want every country to succeed. I want Ukraine to win, but I'm America first, motherfucker. And that's the problem with America. We have politicians that are not America first. They are bought and fucking paid for. And it's a damn shame because at this point, unless there is a revolution, bro, I don't know how the fuck it gets fixed. I paid attention since you were training, but I want to ask you about the Supreme Court decisions this week, the two. Uh, the, I know the Asian and then the student loans, right? Uh, yeah, bro, I fucking, I love America, guys. It's fucking bullshit. Listen, you guys, I'm a white trash motherfucker. So, like, like you know, like, you know, you got these Asian dudes, man. They're fucking got lock, docs and lawyers. Uh, they got to they gotta leg up on me. But, again, America is fucking equal opportunity. If you could fucking do it, fucking do it, man. Bottom line, dude, I'm really happy for the... Uh, for the Asian community, man. Fucking, if you guys work your ass off, you got good parents. And, and that's, to go full circle, you, you see that, that Asian community of like, you have a mom in the house raising their kids. That is what America was. But you let these corporations fucking weasel their way to put the Amazon on your phone and we have just made this consumer America, bro. It is a damn shame that you have foreigners coming to this country and they, and they show more of the American spirit and values than Americans do. When are you going to run? Ah, oh, fuck, man. I have way too much history, my, way too much shit in my past. And then the student loans, man. Fucking A. It's bad that. Man, I was fucking homeschooled my whole life. I mean, I always say I dropped out of high school, but I don't even know if I could call it high school. No, fucking. You, you get your loans, bro. You fucking pay for it. No, one's, no one ever gave me fucking forgiveness. So, yeah, I'm happy the Supreme Court, man. We, we, got a, we got a good fucking roster on that Supreme Court, dude. All we need now is some national reciprocity, and we'll be set. I'm impressed that you paid attention to what was going on in the world while you're in the, the UFC bubble. Well, man, here's the thing, guys. We don't do shit all day. What do you think UFC fighters do? Like, we don't have a job. We train for a few hours a day, and we just sit there with our dicks in our hand. You guys, why do you think I'm fucking tan? I got shit to do all day long. So, yeah, I just sit on the interwebs reading fucking conspiracies about fucking COVID and shit. You know? Congratulations. <laughs> Anti-vaxxer, by the way. I'm not saying vaccines are bad, but, you know, fucking, you try to force me to tell me to get a fucking shove a needle in my ass to leave the country. Fuck you guys.